to be the That's the problem. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna call you a converted Georgia peach. <laughs> oh, you could do that. Did I go ahead and say? Yeah. Even the ones that talk the stuff don't even have the shirt on. You know, I even pay attention to that one. <laughs> okay. Now we are in the personal library of Dr. Boyd. All right. He came along with every single book in this room. 1,500 wow. books. So what's the most historic book that he has in here? Okay, so I'm going to it's show you lot. the oldest book in this room. From 1773. Wow. That's like, that's like, like the birth of America. I'm telling you, technology has changed. Now everybody got digital versions. We have it. By Phillips Whitley, 1973. Wow. Yes, man. Enjoy, enjoy. <laughs> Family, this is incredible history and documentation. And one of the famous books of Dr. Dubois. Can someone mention it for me? The famous book of Dubois. The famous book that he wrote? Mm -hmm. Okay, which book do you want to see? Of the body do you want to see? So right now, so the should I stop? Thank you. Oh, okay, you go. go Scorpion. I'll tell you. So, so like this is one of those pictures of the boy signed to the second wife. Small room family full of a whole lot of documentation. So when did he write that book? You you like your own the place. I do. <laughs> <laughs> and we have a special so book from the boys that he always gives to anyone who will be sitting in this house. The two line books on top. You can see the colors are the same. So as the title in Battle for Peace. So if today Dr. Du Bois is supposed to be alive, each of us receive one of these books from Dr. Du Bois. But because the Bois is gone, maybe you can ask why you get it. Because it's not history. <laughs> and that's the great man's chair. Oh. Okay, there is a curtains, four curtains in this room. Just look at it very well. You have three parties in the curtains. Okay, sorry. Let me stand here so that you can see it very well. One, two, three. So let's look at the middle one. It has something related to Dr. Bois. But if you get it, keep it yourself for now. So don't tell anyone. The middle pattern of the curtains. Let me make it straight. Oh, I think I got it. So you keep it yourself, you don't tell anyone. The last place, I'll show you something similar. Then you can give me the name. It was here when the boys was here.
So before the boys will come to Ghana, he already buried the, fir- the daughter, the son, the first wife, and also the mother before coming to Ghana. Mm-hmm. So the boys came in with the second wife. He got married to the second wife in 1952. 1952, the doctor, the boy was 83 years old, and Shelley was 53 years old. Mm-hmm. So no children from this marriage. But because Shelley was from her first marriage with two boys, so the doctor, the boys adopted a younger one. David Graham Du Bois. And now, because this room was Shelley's office, now dedicate all strong black females who stood up for our rights, our freedom, and our country, like Harriet Topman, Queen Nina, Queen Zenga, Fire Queens, and others more. So let's look around. There is a table behind us. On it are some gifts they receive. Yeah, 